The cost of doing business, man. Clean Kicks 973, we back at it. So let me tell you a quick story. I'm on eBay, of course. I'm online. I'm everywhere. I'm looking for Yeezys, whatever. I catch a guy who sell you selling Yeezys. Mind you, I can't even find his username anymore. So the guy tells me he'll sell me a pair of 750s in a size 9 and a pair of 350 10s in a size nine and a half for two thousand dollars together so i'm thinking that's not a bad deal i'll take it um sell it flip it whatever i gotta do so the guys tell me this and that my job i'm not making a deal worst case scenario is my brother making a deal he's supposed to buy it he ends up not being able to buy it so i'm like yo i'm gonna just steal this deal for myself so i bought his shoes and next thing you know the guy's like um did you pay yet did you pay yet finally pay that night i pay that night next day he sends me tracking label so next thing you know, I'm waiting for my Yeezys to come in, and then it comes in on a Saturday. But of course, I'm not home. My brother picks up the package, and this is what I get. An envelope. Thanks a lot, USPS. He mailed me this. Mind you, he mailed it out. He could have sent me some pictures of the shoes, something at least. I didn't get anything in the package. $2,000. This is what you guys got to be aware about. So I'm going to give you guys a, quick, a couple quick tips on buying sneakers online. First thing to do, you always want to make sure you go through a secured website or something. You want to try something like PayPal because they cover you. And you always got to make sure if you're on PayPal, do not do gifts when you're buying shoes or anything on PayPal. Make sure you do our invoice. The invoice has to be detailed as well. You want to make sure they say 100% authentic. Make sure that they are actually selling these shoes. Make sure you, you're covered. So let's say, worst case scenario, you get something like this. Now you can make a claim with PayPal. And it takes maybe two, three weeks for the claim to go through. But at least you know you're covering you get your money back. I'm gonna keep you guys away from getting certain things You see just the envelope, but look if I had done this PayPal with a gift Payment I would have got nothing back. So always make sure you do gift payment I mean make sure you don't do gift payment make sure you do PayPal anyway And make sure you stay away from doing like sending money to people's bank accounts unless you know That's like your best friend for years or something, but besides that do not do any business Shady business and also remember if you're doing meetups make sure to meet up in the safe places as well because in the past, I've heard crazy stories was going on with people getting robbed for sneakers and everything. So make sure you meet at the mall, somewhere safe where you have no issues. Don't meet on no side street. Don't meet at your house. That's the worst idea ever. A lot of people like to meet at the house. They think it's the safest place, but it really isn't. Some people will come to your house and rob you and leave, and you'll be shit out of luck. So just remember, stay safe when you're making these deals on eBay, Craigslist, all these sneaker websites. Just make sure you do it the secured way. Clean Kicks 973, check us out, and we have more tips for you guys.